Okay, hello again. Um, this is Iron Man Fan One Four showing One Four Seven. Sorry, showing you how to make an enemy in Blender. What is this like? Part four now? I don't know. I don't keep track very well. So, okay. I I couldn't figure out why this thing kept on going up like that. It was real weird. You know what? I forgot to do something. I I hit collision with high. It should be a um, message with... Let's just make it boom. And make this one so when it... Okay. Add, add, add on your enemy cube. Um, change the last one to message. You know, boom. You know, subject boom, I mean. Alright, now add them all. And then hit cube. No, collision with property high, which is your bullet. And it, I don't know if it'll work. Um, might. Yeah, so now I can hit it a couple of times and it goes away. I guess you can't see your health bar for some reason. I don't know why it doesn't. It's just cause, I guess. Cause it likes to. Anyways, I guess you don't need to see the health bar. You just need to know you need to shoot it a couple of times. I don't know if you know how to do it. Just do it. It's, it's more fun. Okay. Here's your character. And, um, I'm not sure what else I can show you. I can show you how to... Let's, I'll get into the map now, I guess. So let's go back into edit mode. Deselect everything. Let's add a border select, which is B, by the way. Make this extrude it up or something. I don't know. Make it go across like this. Um, extrude again, but don't move it. Move it on the. I know it looks really messy, just doesn't matter. It's a game, and it's not going to be much of a game, I guess. You can move this whole thing over. Yeah, I'd, I hit Shift D and now rotate it by pressing R. Control to make it all straight and then connect them. So let's see what it does now. I don't think the enemy will actually follow me. Well, he might. Anyways, so now that I didn't hit, now that I didn't click rigid body or anything, it um, hey, he is following me. Anyways, so I won't, like, fall on this. Prepare for your doom cube. Oh, he fell off the edge. Anyways, I don't know, something cool. Add some cool things. Add some more of them. I'm just shift D every single one. Oh, well, that would be good. Just keep on clicking shift D. Keep on adding them. Because the more, the more fun it is. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, wow. That was not good. Don't do that if you have the health bar, I guess. Because they all go by the same health bar. So... Yeah, they all go at once. Let's see. Uh, I can hit one a million times and they all go. It's kind of funny. Oh no, I got it. I got it. I know what to do now. Get rid of all those. And then... Dum, da 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 dum, da 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 dum, da 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 dum, da 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 dum. Super massive giant cube. Oh, I push you off the edge. You're owned. So yeah, there are a lot of really fun things you can do with Blender. Here's something I guess cool you might want to do. Um, you'll have to get rid of the. This is an optional video, actually. This is only for random stuff. If you want it, I'll clear the parent for the target thing so it's still there I just cleared it from the camera so it's not
comparing it to the camera anymore. I'll parent it to the cube instead. And I'll click that. Get a close up on it. I'll hit E and extrude. Make sure it's on the X axis. So it's kind of three dimensional. And make the camera add, add, add. You can do whatever you want with Blender. That's what I love about it. Let's change that to add a, add a random. No, let's make this easy. Um, so many things you can do. You can change your view. Even though this will mess up your targeting, I'm guessing, a lot. You can still have fun with it. I own you again. <laughs> so I can do that with the... Wee. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, bye bye cube. So yeah, I think I'm gonna do this more often, I like giving Blender tutorials, even though my tutorials are probably numbered wrong, this is kind of fun. Um, just to say something, if you want to look at some real professional Blender tutorials, I recommend going to, um, this guy named Super 3 Boy awesome tutorials he taught me almost every single single thing I know single thing I know <laughs> but he he taught us he taught me a lot so um check out his channel really good tutorials um on almost everything you could ever think of he has them um he's doing in the new type blender the new version I got the second newest version I got it a year ago so yeah, rate, subscribe, comment, um, comment to his videos too, he's got a lot of comments, I mean he's that good, so, yeah, thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next tutorials.